Okay, here we take uh, x as u and then the expression sine 3x uh, cosine square 3x as uh, dv by dx. So first uh, I write them separately u equals uh, x and then uh, dv by dx this equals uh, sine 3x cosine squared 3x and uh, this side we differentiate that is uh, du equals uh, dx and this side uh, we have to integrate so we get uh, v and this one is uh, v equals is already given as part of the question which is negative cosine cube 3x over 9. So now we can use the integration by parts uh, formula that is uh, we are evaluating this uh, integral x uh, sine 3x and then uh, cosine squared 3x dx and so this is uh, in the form of uh, we have considered this x as u and then this expression as uh, dv by dx. So when you multiply this with uh, dx, you will get uh, only dv. So the integration formula is, uh, this is in the form of the integration by parts uh, formula that is uh, u dv. This one is u and the second expression is dv. And according to this formula, integral of u dv, this equals uh, uv minus uh, integral v du. So basically we are evaluating this uh, integral using this uh, formula. Now let's uh, replace uh, u and v. u is uh, x and uh, v is, uh, we have already found that is, this one is this expression. That is negative cosine cube 3x. This is uh, over 9 minus uh, integral of uh, v. Replace v by negative cosine cube 3x over 9 and then du is uh, dx. So we put uh, dx here. Let's simplify this. And so this equals, uh, we have a negative here. So it is a negative x cosine cube 3x over 9. And here we have a product of two negatives, which is a positive. And I also factor the 1 by 9 out of the integral. And then we have to integrate uh, cosine cube 3x. I also put this uh, constant of integration now. So I'm going to consider this as uh, equation 1. That is, uh, we are basically finding the integral of the expression x sine x cosine square 3x. This equals uh, this expression. We are now going to uh, find the integral of this uh, expression separately. That is, uh, let's uh, find integral of uh, cosine cube 3x and then we will replace into this equation. And so this equals, so we don't have a standard formula to integrate uh, cosine cube 3x. However, we can rewrite this uh, by using a cosine triple angle uh, identity. That is uh, sine 3x. This is an identity equals uh, 4 cosine cube x minus 3 cosine x. And since we want uh, 3x uh, here, that is uh, we want uh, 3x here, so we should replace all x by 3x here. Replacing x by 3x and then multiplying by 3, we will have cosine 9x here. And this equals uh, 4 cosine cube, we now replace x by 3x, so it is uh, cosine cube 3x minus uh, this one is uh, 3 cosine 3x. So here we solve for uh, cosine cube 3x by adding this uh, term first on both sides and dividing by 4. So solving for this one we get uh, cosine cube 3x and this gives uh, cosine 9x plus 
we'll just move this a little further. 3 cosine 3x. This uh, divided by 4. So we can replace uh, this uh, cosine cube 3x uh, as uh, this uh, expression on the right side. So we can write this uh, integral. This is uh, equal to integral of uh, cosine 9x plus 3 cosine 3x. This is uh, 3 cosine 3x. We move this uh, closer. 3 cosine 3x. And this is over 9. I'm sorry, over 4. And then we integrate with respect to dx. We make this little bit shorter. We have utilized this. And so first uh, I factor out the 1 by 4 out of the integral. So this will be 1 by 4. And then I write this uh, expression into two parts. This is the first one and this is the second term. So basically we can write this as 1 by 4 multiplied with integral of uh, cosine 9x plus we should put uh, dx. Plus the second integral will be 3 cosine 3x dx. We close this bracket for the multiplier 1 by 4. So let's uh, put the multiplying factor 1 by 4. And then integral of uh, cosine 9x. We can use the u substitution method by replacing uh, u uh, 9x by u. So it will be cosine u. And then if, uh, if we replace uh, 9x by u, this will be 9dx equals uh, du. So dx is du over 9. So this will become cosine u and uh, du by 9. I'm writing here. So let's uh, put this here, integral of uh, cosine u and then uh, du by 9. And similarly, we can also do the substitution over here. So we have uh, 3 times of uh, cosine 3x. This uh, here we replace uh, 3x by u. So this will be 3x equals u and dx equals uh, du over 3. So cosine 3x will be cosine u multiplied with uh, dx is uh, du by 3. Let's integrate uh, and do the back substitution. Remember that uh, we have made a two if substitution. The first one is for 9x and the second one is for 3x. So let's uh, continue integrating. This will be 1 fourth. We have 1 by 9. So we factor 1 by 9 and then integrate uh, cosine u. And here we see that uh, this 3 and this 3 will get uh, cancelled out. And we just have the integral of uh, cosine u du. Maybe we can change this to some other variables. Let's say this v v w. I'm changing this uh, everything to w to avoid uh, any confusion. This one is uh, w. So here also this is uh, w. So this will be t w by three. This will also be dw's. Now we can uh, integrate uh, in the next step. So we have this uh, multiplied 1 by 4 times uh, 1 by 9. Integral of cosine u is uh, sine u. And then this one is integral of cosine w is uh, sine w. We have integrated, let's uh, do the back substitution. u is uh, 9x and w is uh, 3x. And so therefore, this equals, in fact, we can distribute this uh, 1 fourth now. So this will be 136 sine u is replaced as, uh, this one is uh, 9x. 
so this is uh, u sine of uh, 9x plus uh, multiply this 1 by 4 this will be 1 fourth of uh, sine w is uh, 3x so it is uh, sine 3x and uh, so this is the actual integral of uh, cosine cube 3x so we put this in uh, equation 1 and uh, simplify that replacing that uh, in equation 1 we write the first term that is uh, negative x uh, cosine cube uh, 3x by 9 I'm writing this uh, first term equals uh, negative x cosine cube uh, 3x over 9 plus we have 1 by 9 times the integral so I put uh, 1 by 9 times the integral of cosine cube uh, 3x which is uh, this expression so let me replace this so here we have uh, 1 by 36 sine 9x plus uh, 1 by 4 sine 3x we also put the constant of integration plus c now we can uh, simplify this uh, here we have uh, sine 9x and here we have uh, sine 3x uh, we can use uh, sine uh, triple angle to reduce this to uh, sine 3x and then combine this with uh, sine 3x so let's do that this first term will remain as it is that is negative x uh, cosine cube uh, 3x this is uh, divided by 9 plus uh, we have 1 by 9 times uh, 1 by 36 I'm going to use the triple angle identity for sine function that is uh, sine 3x equals 3 sine x minus uh, 4 sine cube x and since we want uh, sine 9x we are going to replace this x by 3x so that we get uh, sine 9x and this equals uh, we replacing x by 3x so all x has to be replaced by 3x so this will become 3 sine 3x minus uh, 4 sine cube 3x so we have uh, return sine line x using the triple angle identity so let's uh, replace sine line x uh, as this expression which is uh, 3 sine 3x minus uh, 4 sine cube 3x close this bracket and then we have a uh, plus 1 fourth of sine 3x close this bracket plus we put c now let's simplify this we have a negative x cosine cube 3x this is the first term divided by 9 plus uh, let's uh, distribute uh, everything so first i'm going to distribute this 1 by 9 so 1 by 9 times 1 by 36 equals uh, we should multiply the denominators which is uh, 1 by 324 so this will be 1 by 324 times we have 3 sine 3x minus uh, 4 sine cube uh, 3x plus next i distribute this uh, 1 by 4 with this i'm sorry 1 by 9 with this 1 by 4 uh, sine 3x so it will be 1 by 36 sine 3x we put the constant c the next step uh, we will distribute this uh, 1 by 324 to the terms inside the bracket so we will put the first term as it is that is a negative x uh, cosine cube 3x this is over 9 plus uh, 
this will be 3 times uh, 1 by 324 times 3. We can reduce this to a simple fraction. 324 divided by 3. This goes 108 times. So I can reduce this to 1 over 108. So this will be sine 3x over 108. The first term I write this as uh, sine 3x over 108 and uh, when we distribute this uh, 1 over 324 times uh, negative 4 it's basically 1 over 324 times negative 4 so we can divide uh, 324 by 4 which goes uh, 81 times so the second term will be sine cube uh, 3x over 81 because uh, this goes uh, 81 times and then uh, we have this uh, last term which is uh, 1 by 36 sine 3x this one is uh, 1 by 36 of sine 3x plus uh, constant c in the next step uh, we simplify by combining these two like terms so I put this uh, first term as it is, that is uh, negative x cosine cube uh, 3x uh, over 9. And I put this as the second term, which is a negative of sine cube uh, 3x over 81. And then uh, when combining these two like terms, the denominator is 108 for this one. And here it is uh, 36, so the common denominator is uh, 108. And this means uh, we can write this numerator as it is, that is uh, sine 3x. And here we have to multiply and divide by 3. So this will be plus uh, 3 sine 3x over the common denominator, which is uh, 108. We then put uh, plus c. Sine 3x plus 3 sine 3x is uh, 4 sine 3x. So let me replace this by 4 sine 3x. So this basically is uh, 4 sine 3x uh, over 108, which is reduced it to this goes as uh, 27 times. So it is uh, sine 3x over 27. This means now we can combine all these terms uh, by using the common denominator. And the common denominator equals uh, 81. So I put uh, the common, sorry about it. Okay, I'm just going to draw a line to indicate the division. So I put this uh, common denominator which is 81. So this uh, numerator has to be multiplied by 9. So it becomes a negative 9x cosine cube 3x. And this one we write as it is negative sine cube 3x. And this one we should multiply by 3. So this will be plus 3 sine 3x. And so this is the integral of the given expression we should also put the constant of integral that is uh, plus c okay.